All right, everyone, now that we've unboxed the Pixel 7 Pro, it's time to look at two of the best clear cases for this phone, which are the Spigen Ultra Hybrid and the Ring Key Fusion case that I have right here. The first case we are looking at is the Spigen Ultra Hybrid, and I already unboxed the case so we don't have to waste time on that. So let me go ahead and put the case on the phone. And the first thing I usually like to do is check if the buttons are nice and clicky, which is actually the case here. And as you can see, the cutouts are also quite precise at the bottom of the phone. The phone is protected well. There is a good lip around the display as well. And then obviously we have the camera cutout and the camera bar being protected by that plastic piece as well. Overall, it's a pretty nice and a solid case that I have used in the past as well. Last year I used it for the Pixel 6 and after one year of use, you can actually see how well it has held up. It is obviously a bit yellow which is the case with clear cases and let me try to take it off of the Pixel 6 and you can exactly see how the case is looking after one year of use. A lot of year and tear but for $15 I feel this is one of the best bang for your buck that you can have for your phone. And the next case that we have is the Ring Key Fusion case which I actually prefer over the Spigen Ultra Hybrid and we'll talk about why that is. Let me remove this case from the phone and let's put the Ring Key case on the Pixel. And the first thing we'll check is the button clickiness which you can see is once again quite nice. There is also the textured power button so that's also a good touch from Ring Key. Bottom cutouts are also quite precise. The camera cutout is actually better than the Spigen because I like this cutout more than this full cutout. So that's actually also one of the reasons I prefer the Rinky case. And then obviously we have a nice lip around the display to protect the display. And overall I prefer this case like I mentioned because of the textured power button and this camera cutout. And yeah, but other than that both cases are quite similar. They're also around the same price, which is I feel like $15 Canadian or 16. So you can use any of these cases you want for the Pixel 7 Pro and you'll get good protection with the best bang for your buck. So that's about for this video guys. Hopefully you liked it. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and I will see you guys in the next one.